Thank you for turning into another episode of I Tried Crypto. This is Andrew. Um, today I'm actually going over an unboxing uh, of my first graphics card from StockX. Um, bought this just over a month ago, right at the very end of 2021. Um, big, big, big uh, bull market. Um, hard to get GPUs. Um, GPUs you can get, you may not want to pay the right price, or they're just unprofitable for a really long time, or even ROI is just unprofitable. Um, so I went and took a stab and bought the, uh, I believe it's the 6700 XT um, by AMD. Um, got it on um, a decent price, you can see right there, from StockX. Um, as I go through the unboxing, I mean, it's it's pretty straightforward. It's the box, you know, was it or used or not? I really can't say. If it was used, I would say it's definitely not heavily used. Um, but I mean, I've been running this card now for over a month. Haven't had any issues with it. Um, I chose to go after, go through StockX, um, mainly because I'm just not a big fan of face-to-face. -face. Don't really want to carry a lot of cash around with me. And the last thing I really want to do is, you know, hand over cash, walk away with the GPU, and then find out the GPU doesn't work or something else. Um, again, this here's the box. You'll see that they open it up. Um, I'm not really sure if they test it for me or not. Um, if they did, it would explain why there's a little bit of marks you'll see at the end of the video if I got them on camera. Um, just kind of the scratch marks um, that are on the gold fins that go into the PCIe slot. Um, just normal marks you would expect. Not, not that the graphics card was necessarily scratched. Um, again, this card was listed as new. Um, I bought it as new. It was cheaper for me to buy this card through StockX with their fee than it was for me to actually buy it from, uh, from what was it, Newegg. Newegg had a card and it was about 30, I think $40 higher at the time. Um, same type of card, same hash rate, everything else. Um, price I got this card for was just under $20 a mega hash. Um, again, you can say it's a good deal, you can say it's a bad deal. Um, I'm new to crypto, I don't really want older cards, I'm trying to avoid them. Um, are they out there? Yes. Are they expensive right now? Yes. Um, but I really don't see much value in buying a card that's four or five years old that can give me the same mega hash that I can buy a current card for, even if it happens to be an AMD card. Um, right now, just in my crypto journey, I have one NVIDIA card. I'll, I'll show that in another video later. Um, but I've been pretty content with AMD cards, haven't had an issue. Um, as prices go down, I definitely think that I'll be buying more from StockX um, or anywhere else that I can get graphics cards, um, preferably new. Again, this card here was tested, or at least inspected. I have had zero issues with this so far. Um, you know, if you're buying graphics cards somewhere and you're not paying a ridiculously high amount, I would love to hear where you're getting them from. Um, I have not had that luck. Um, for me, it's kind of like either you pay the the new the new normal price, which is not really scalper pricing, but it is in, inflated over the MSRP. Um, or you're buying them from scalpers, and you, know, you run the you run the risk of getting what you can get from scalpers. Um, overall, I'm not particularly a fan of them, just because you know they're making a profit by screwing you over. Um, versus if you bought it, even if you bought it 10 to 20 percent more, you got a fee. I would have no issue with that. But it's going through here. My light came off, so sorry about that. I went to fix that. Um, and then I just kind of go over really just doing a good examination of the card. Um, I was really honestly expecting to get scammed. Um, I've watched some videos on StockX. Some of the things have been really helpful. Some of the things have been absolutely terrible. And I personally thought that I was going to be scammed. Um, thankfully, I wasn't. It's definitely a good deal. I would definitely buy another card again. So if you're interested about StockX, hopefully my experience will help you. Um, I, again, I plan to buy more in the future as I can financially afford it. Um, I do think we're going into a different time with crypto, but it is what it is. Thank you for watching an episode of I Tried Crypto. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe. Yes, I am a new YouTuber. Yes, I'm a new uh, crypto person. Um, I have a lot of hobbies, but right now crypto is the one, and maybe that one will stick with me for a while. So thank you again for watching, and keep mining.